This is my dancey dance because I have officially finished everything to be considered. I, I'm a co I am, I've earned my Bachelor's of Arts. The sun is currently peering through. I've never seen the sun directly come into my room like this. I'm in a great mood. I'm done my classes. experience there we go <laughs> yeah this one just goes right there but it is my favorite place to get pads and not tampons apparently because they're never out unfortunately it seems the classrooms have been closed but on the third floor you'll be met with beautiful pieces of armor so you can see the Brooklyn Bridge that's kind of cute Just as let down. Here's the second floor. Just as ugly and a bit smaller because half of it is the library. It seems like they're closed. But these are the only two lecture halls that we have on campus. Yeah. They seat about probably a hundred people, but there's never a hundred people in those classes. To be and that's really the only classes that you'll have on the second floor are your lectures. So hopefully they redo that floor sometime soon. all my classes and now I have to pack up and move out of this room by Monday um, it is currently Friday that's what I'm doing today and tomorrow and so let's do a last capture little room tour I was gonna do a separate video for this but I decided why not just throw it all into one so this is my 2021-2022 senior year dorm tour on Maria's Tower Peace University New York City let's go Stop. For starting at my door, I have lots of fun stuff going on, but above my door, I have my little prayer flags. I have all my visitors' guest passes on my door. I have my negative COVID test. I have my positive COVID test. I have my vaccine mandate. It's a late show. Um, so yeah, that's my door. And then I have this little Amazon, um, the Star Tapestry. And then I have two of these wardrobes, right? Because this is supposed to be a two-person dorm, I have double of everything. So I have my hamper up there and my camera stuff. And then over here I just have my suitcases, my shower caddy, um, and then like my toothbrush and my face wash and stuff. So in this wardrobe, I just have all my coats, my shower towels, my sheets, my reusable bags. And then yeah, this is all my winter 
gear like my my hats my scarves you're going to need hella coats <laughs> if you're moving to New York City because winters are terrible you need your black puffer of course not too exciting this is my little rolly cart this is my tarot section so I have all my cards here I just have some cute little pictures Polaroids um, this is from an event I put on. This is from an event I put on. Some post-it notes from all my finals. To make one other thing clear, usually this dorm, it's 200 square feet. It's usually shared between two freshmen. It's a freshman dorm. Um, but I paid a little bit extra and got my own dorm to myself without having to be an RA or anything like that. I just have my own dorm, so that's the only reason why. This was okay because we're also the only dorm on campus that does not have bathrooms in our own dorm, so we have communal bathrooms. And this is my desk, so this is pretty much my vanity. I made this one like my vanity and that one my like work desk. The thing is, when I stole this from out there, and to good luck to the good luck to the custodians who have to dismantle this. But we'll get to that later. Hi, first of all, hi in another mirror. Uh, also, welcome to my skincare fridge. I don't have a fridge or a microwave in my room, so my family was kind enough to get me a skincare fridge for all my needs, which can fit one pomegranate juice. So, things, my hair clips, my earrings, and then the CD rack, you probably remember this from last year too, it holds all my earrings. I collect earrings from everywhere I travel to, so I really just like love them. My Brita, my tissues some flowers. I usually get flowers from Trader Joe's whenever I go. And it has these two shelves. So this has like my hair scars and like belts and stuff, my nail stuff. This has all my hair stuff in it. And here I have all my makeup. That was at a good bill. And it holds literally everything else. So it has some setting spray. Some I really like these. These are reusable makeup removers. So as you can see, I have two beds. Originally I slept on this one. And then one night I couldn't sleep so I completely just threw a fit and I moved on to this one and I haven't gone back. I really like being able to like open the window and close the window and like feel the breeze. But below this one I just have a jam that I need to return. All my shoes. I just have this little shoe rack from Five Below. And bass guitar. It's and like my firefly pass. I have this pillow. This is my school's mascot, so I got a little T-bone from, this is from Homecoming. My projector, so you might have realized that like, decor-wise, it's really bare right here. And that's just because this is where my projector shines. This all year, this is the same sign as earlier, and I still need it to be honest, but here's my second desk. This is my work desk. Thumb drive has all my radio shows on it. I have some finger lights too, don't forget. My snack bin, so it has crazy stuff in it. Um, instant coffee, your best friend, really. And then I have some forks, some tea, some coffee over here. This is supposed to be a compost bin, but I kind of just hung it on the side. And it has like all my seasoning, so salt, everything with bagel, nutritional yeast, honey, all of it. Here, this is my little kitchen, kitchen set over here, you can even call it that. Um, so the only appliance that I have in my room is a kettle. But it actually lets me infuse like tea, so like this tea is from Hawaii when I went and I've been making tea with it, but I also can make a lot of other stuff. My view, I'm so happy that all the trees are finally green again. Freaking, I will definitely miss my view, I really do like it, I really think it's cool. But, and then there's my school, that's all Pacey University, and then that's the Brooklyn Bridge. I'm like, I'm like winded, this is a lot of talking guys. Okay, so at the bottom of my desk, my work desk, I have this. This is literally like all the books that I've just collected. And then up here, I just have all my notebooks. And then we move to my altar. Ooh. My altar is my trash. And this box of snacks that my mom just sent me. You can see a full haul on Gilly Eats Video on TikTok. Right here with my little crystal triangle, I found this. Just a couple months ago at Target, actually, for like $5, and I thought it was perfect for all my crystals, so. This is my little selenite tower. So I have my singing bowl, some sleep spray, my evil eye, friendship candle that I need to burn, 
my incense holder, some lighters, some essential oils, my plants which are growing. So this is Chase the Money. He is my money tree. He has this beautiful new offshoot. Growing great. Love how he's doing. Yeah. And then I have some incense. A little kitty. My candles. So cute. My little Han Solo. My dead plant. Don't let her fool you. She is dead. And then, yeah, my other plant. This is Sebastian. This is the mirror that comes with the dorm. So I've put some, you know, postcards up as in my fashion. This is my bed. I'm so excited to leave these pillows and never sleep on such an uncomfortable thing again. For the past two years, I have been living with this type of mech support. My records and my lights, some eucalyptus that I bought from Trader Joe's. That's my, that's my bedroom collage right there. Last but not least is this little corner. So here's my second chair stacked on top of each other. And then my second wardrobe, I have some bags right here. All of my sweaters, they're a mess, I know, but I'm packing up to go home. My actual shirts, so. Also, I have some awesome roller skates. So yeah, guys, that's it. That's my 200 square New York City dorm tour. Um, I hope you liked it. If you live in Maria's 1611, just know that I also lived here. Look above the panel on the left hand side of the room. And yeah, um, it's been a great year. I'm sad to deconstruct my dorm as every college student is, but I'm excited to see what's next in my life. I graduate college in four days and this chapter is over. Please welcome Jillian Holland. Here is Lauren Cotter. Please welcome.